Hi all, Max from Metro Hobbies. Time to show you some new stuff. We've had a fair bit in, so let's have a look. Okay, we've had a lot of new stuff in. There's been all sorts of things from Roden, Tacom, everything else, so let's have a look at what we've had. Okay, an oldie but goodie. This was, came out years and years ago. This is the 007 Moonraker, so it comes with the Moonraker and all the rest of it. So that's not too bad. Uh, from Roden, we've got this. Now, this was obviously on the cards. They've done the, t the version of it singly, so there they've done the two. You get the two kits in there with the conversion to make it into the Zwilling. 1144 scale, that's in. Also, the Vampire's in from um, IMF. I'll t do some more information for that for you later. Got restocks from Kinetic of the two Australian Mirages, so that's pretty cool. Uh, this is the Border Models uh, 135th scale Stuka. Um, we've also got the Lancaster, but we're down to one or two left of the Lancasters, and I believe that's it. So if you want one, grab one now. This is the Tacon Flying Bomb with the launch ramp. I'll show you a bit more about that later. This is the Flying Bomb, though, with all the interior parts. It comes with two fuselages, so it's got a clear fuselage and a standard fuselage, so that you can show them off both ways. Spitfire from uh, Airfix, that's the continuation of the series that they're currently doing in 48 scale. Uh, just a quick one on this one. If you haven't got this, you need to get it in and get, get it quickly because we're running out. We have very few left, so if you're chasing one, grab it now. I'm not sure when we're going to get some more. Across the top uh, from MPC, uh, we've got the Wacky Racers, so all those that know um, Penelope Pitstop and the Over the Hill Gang and all that sort of stuff. Nice little kit. Uh, it's a build and play type of thing. I think it's 30 second scale, so it's not 24. And then you've got the MPC Monopoly car, which is a bit novel. That's the 48 scale Hurricane. And that is the uh, Hasegawa kit, which is a lovely kit in its own right. So that's been re-released. Some more from Tacom. Uh, that's the later version of the Deflinger from 1917. We've also got uh, the Mobile Wagon from Border. So that's 35th scale. And then to finish these two off, we've got a couple of figures for you. This is the Bandai Batman. I think this is the modern one. The, yeah, the more modern one. And then this is Wonder Woman. This is done by Mobius. So it's based on the old kit that came out years ago um, from the classic TV series. So uh, very, very nice. It's um, one eight scale, so pretty cool. Okay, let's see what else is on the shelves. So there's been, as I said, quite a bit of stuff come in. Let's have a look at the armor side. ICM, we're still waiting on a shipment that's coming. It's not far off. From Das Work, we've had a few new ones from them as well. You've got the T72 and their iteration of the Tiger. This is the late version. So they're quite good. A bit little bit of stuff from Dragon. Uh, also from Das Work is that one. And uh, that's the German artillery piece. So that's quite good. So there's been a little bit from uh, DAS work. Um, TACOM, of course, I said to you before, we've had a big shipment of TACOM, a lot of reissues, things like that. So lots, there's the V1 bomb again, various uh, gun sets and everything else. Amusing, they've got a couple of new things coming out. We'll talk about that uh, when they do arrive. Bit of Airfix again on the other side. We've had restocks from Roden of their um, Silverside bus, which has been very, very popular. That's a great, great kit. It's 35th scale, but it's um, been very, very popular, so that's been good. Um, what else have we had? There's a bit more from oh, Gecko, the usual one. This is still one of the most popular ones. Uh, we're getting down on them a little bit, so you might want to chase that up if you're looking for one. Uh, various items from IBG, some new 35th scale, restocks, things like that. We've had some Tamiya Taker. Oh, this is Rich. We've had restocks from these guys. Uh, we've been a while trying to get hold of these guys, so it's taken a while, but that's quite nice in 35th scale. This is a company that we uh, came across as GMU, 48 scale Huck starter for um, 48 scale aircraft, World War I types, all that type of thing. It's a nice little kit. It doesn't seem a lot in it, but it actually makes up very, very nice. So that's 48 scale. Uh, Mini Art. Now, Mini Art uh, have just notified me that they've got an order ready to go, so look out in the next probably four weeks or so, depending on freight out of Ukraine, whether we can, uh, we'll get restocks of a lot of uh, mini art and new items. They've got some whole lot of new stuff coming up quickly. So that's very good. Hat, uh, all those sort of guys, Strelitz, 
UM, more Roden. As I said, we've got a restock of the 72nd scale Roden. So there's a lot of that stuff coming through. The usual story, our Tamirs are good. Um, don't forget the AFE Club M113 Australian type. Such a big seller. If you want to grab one, grab one soon. Uh, other than that, uh, Ming, Hobby Boss, I believe there's another shipment of that due shortly. So there's quite a bit to come through. Mini Art, Master Box, a whole lot of those companies are really looking good for the very, very near future. Hopefully we'll have most of it before November. Okay, so let's see what else we've had in. Resox of the Vulcan, this is massively, massively popular. So if you really want to get one, get hold of one. It's such a nice kit way 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 better than the old original one that they put out years ago uh, from uh, Bandai we've got more Batmobiles there's various types well, various versions actually you can almost build all, all the different versions that's the Batman we saw before border models uh, that's their Crusader there then we've got some other ones down there Jupiter 2 again is back in stock from um, Mobius so that's quite good and of course We've got restocks of the Thunderbird 1 and Thunderbird 1 launch bay. Yeah. Okay, so we're back in aviation or into aviation. A lot of uh, restock mostly. Hasn't been a much new stuff, but we're waiting on all sorts of various things. I showed you the Airfix Spitfire before, but that's about the only new thing. If we go down this side, just lots of restock. The uh, Lancaster 2, very, very popular. This is quite good too, especially with the current situation. Memorial flight, that's nice. Um, uh, special hobby academy it's basically it's all restock type of stuff on this side this is your 48 scale we're expecting some uh, restocks of all the new Edward and all that sort of thing so that Wildcat and all that will be in soon we've had a big restock from uh, Zukimura um, which has been very very popular a lot of it's gone if you were chasing the 32nd scale uh, ME109 we have completely sold out of it we do have some more coming, but if you're gonna, if you want it, you're gonna have to get on and order it with us, um, because we're not sure how many more we're gonna get. So chase that up if you're looking for the 30 second scale one. As I said, Zuki Mura. Uh, what else have we got? Oh, various ones. This is another new one from Hobby 2000. That's the Draken. That's uh, that's the Hasegawa kit. It's in 70 second scale. Uh, really lovely kit in its day, and still is. So that's quite good. Uh, we got a special hobby. Uh, we've had lots of restocks from various groups. We're waiting on our Z. Uh, that's actually due shortly. RS models, um, they've got two new aircraft about to come out, both German, uh, the JU-86P and the 86P2 or something or other it is. On the other side, 48 scale. Again, just lots of restock. We've got plenty of stock, so the place is full. So we're getting more and more, and as we run up to Christmas, a lot of the uh, restock will come through as well, so that's pretty cool. Um, what else we got? Oh, this is a couple more from um, Hobby 2000. So you've got that one and Stuka, quite quite nice. Had a lot of uh, restock for, for the KP and a lot of new items. We've sold out of a few of them because they've proved very popular, so we'll have some more in shortly. A couple of the interesting ones. This is the Samson SA2 and the Brigitte BR14A. Uh, haven't been done in 70 second scale before, so if you're a World War I aficionado, then you might want to um, chase up these guys. There's also, there's actually uh, four or five in the series, so that's pretty cool. Um, as I said, a bit more restock of Roden, especially these ones. These are quite popular. These go quite well. Into 30 second scale, uh, mostly restocks from Zukimura. There's some more from Hobby 2000. Still got uh, a few left of the Hobby Boss A26 if he's chasing one of them. Uh, all through here, high calls. Um, that's the Whirlwind. That is probably Special Hobby's most popular kit at the present time. 30 second scale. Just a lovely, lovely kit. Uh, as I said, ICM, there's a whole lot of stuff coming in the near future, hopefully the Beaufort. Don't forget too, um, Airfix is 24th scale Spitfire, which we're expecting in the very near future. Uh, jump on board with that because it might be limited the first shipment because it's proving extremely popular in England and places like that. So if you want one, get in and order it. Um, make sure you cover it so you we get enough to cover you for all of you. Um, airliners and things like that. There's been a couple of different ones. That's the Reebok with paint and glue for the Concorde done in VA markings. Uh, 
uh, what else we got now? We're into ships. So there's been very not actually to be honest, this but hasn't been much in the way of ships. We have had lots of restocks though from Aoshima, Fujimi. Um, we we're expecting new shipments from Verify very soon. Um, but uh, other than that, it's just basically the restocks. A lot of wooden ships. If you're into wooden ships or you've got a family member that's into wooden ships and would like to try it, come and talk to us first. Don't just jump in and buy the biggest, best whatever because it ain't going to work. Uh, I've had people try to buy the big Endeavour. The Endeavour is one of the hardest ones to build. Don't do that. But if they want to try a wooden ship, come down and talk to us or come to the stores and talk to us. We'll show you what's good. Uh, we've had some classics from Airfix. These dates back so far, but everybody loves them. We still get them. Uh, that's Belfast, which is still exist. Things like that. More ships, things like that. So, sci-fi, uh, Gundam. For those people who are into Gundam, we've got quite a bit. But if you're just into sci-fi and things like that, we've got all these sort of things, which essentially Hasegawa's taking a basic kit and putting um, weird markings in, basically. <laughs> uh, we've got redstones. We've got things like that. Up the top there, there's all very, that's the big Yamato. We still have a few of them left, so come in and grab one of them if you've got the room and the space and the time. So that's pretty cool. Uh, cars. Now, we've got lots and lots of restock of the Tamir cars, which have been a little bit in short supply lately, but there's been a heap of them come in, as you can see by the, the shelves are really, really full. Uh, Aoshima, Fujimi, uh, there's been a lot of that sort of come in, sort of all these sort of ones nice. That's the GT40. In 24th, uh, the Golf. If you've got a Golf, you want to do a model of a Golf, there you go. So there's all those sort of good things. Aoshima, as I said, Fujimi. Hasegawa, we had a lot of Hasegawa. If you're into a, well, there you go. Grab one of them. 24th scale, lovely kit. All through there, and that's and motorbikes, of course. We've got quite a few motorbikes. A um, bit more of the sci-fi through there. Okay, continuing on, we had lots of trucks come in. We've been a bit, again, a bit short on them lately, so we've had a, a very good restock from Italy, Ravel, things like that. Also, large-scale cars. This is 16th-scale Porsche, if you're into them. Very, very nice. Nice kit. Quite a good one. Uh, what else have we had? But as I said, there's been various trucks. We've got even containers. There you go. And trailer. Oh, that's a trailer, actually. 40-foot container trailer. And if you need the, tr need the container... There's the container. So there you go. So that's there's all sorts of things. Want to do some Land Rovers, Range Rovers, Italeri, 24th scale. There's about four or five different versions of that. Uh, various cars. This is a one new in from Ravel. So it gives you the trailer and the and the other car on top. So you get basically you're getting three models in there, which is pretty cool. Uh, back into sci-fi. So we're back into all the Bandai stuff, so the Batmans, a bit, bit of uh, Millennium Falcon, there's that one. And for those that are, remember the old days of the sci-fi and everything else, remember the old Speed Racer? Well, there you go. There's a kit of it, so it's come back out. So it hasn't been out for a little while, so if you're chasing one and you, or just nostalgia purposes, it's back in stock. So, so that's it, guys. So that's a bit of a run-through from the store, uh, for the CBD, CBD store. So if you're in Melbourne area, Drop in to see us in here in the CBD store or drop in a Box Hill. Or if you're going online and you just want to see what else we've got because we can't hold everything, jump online, metrohobbies.com.au. Have a great day and I'll talk to you again.